tightly bunched with Felix lead of one. Well, Nick, we're just sitting here calling a golf tournament. When in the last half hour we get news behind the scenes and we've been trying to come to grips with the uh, very, very sad uh, announcement that uh, we've lost a true broadcasting, sports broadcasting legend and a friend of ours uh, here today. That being Frank Gifford has uh, passed away at the age of 84. I'm going to try to do justice to this, uh, having just received this news, but the family uh, released a statement just a short while ago saying it is with deep sadness that we announced the sudden passing of our beloved husband, father, and friend. Frank died suddenly this beautiful Sunday morning of natural causes at his Connecticut home. Now, Frank would have turned uh, 85 uh, next Sunday. And, of course, he was uh, the golden boy of giant football, a star at USC, Pro Football Hall of Famer, inducted back in 1977. He had that life as a football hero, and then, of course, he had his legendary broadcasting iconic career as well that began uh, right here at CBS, actually, back in the, in the mid-'60s, calling Giants football with Chris Shankle. He actually even called golf uh, for about a three-year span, including the Masters Tournament, 69, 70, and 71. And then it was in 71 he went off to ABC and started that remarkable run of Monday Night Football for so many years. Uh, all of us at CBS, so many of us knew Frank. Uh, our hearts go out to the family, to Kathy Lee and his five children, Frank Gifford, uh, passing away today at the age of 84.